Welcome back, everyone. We've got some special guests joining us this morning. 1031 Consortium is gearing up for its annual Black and Orange Bash this weekend. All the fun is kicking off Saturday. Joining me now to fill us in on all the fun information is Kelly Stein and Ziggy the Alien. Good morning to you both. Good, Good morning. morning. <laughs> so tell us a little bit about this weekend. Uh, we're at the halfway point to Halloween, which is actually my favorite holiday. I can't wait for Halloween. Mm -hmm. What does 1031 Consortium do, Kelly? Um, with with this fundraiser. Okay, so 1031 Consortium is kind of like a Toys for Tots for Halloween. Mm -hmm. So we provide costumes uh, for kids in need, and then we also help neighborhoods have safe trick or treat practices for their kids. Um, and so this is our spring fundraiser and our Halloween celebration. And uh, so it's going to take place this Saturday, April 27th, at uh, the Green Oaks Reception Center on Florida from six to nine. And you can find out more info at Black. And orange bash.com on how to get tickets. And it's going to be a really, really fun event. Ziggy, what can people expect if they come out to this black and orange bash this weekend? Oh, it's going to be a lot of fun. There's going to be uh, a special performance by the beignets, a silent auction, appetizers, a cash bar. Uh, oh, don't forget to wear black and orange. But also, we're going to announce the parade theme this year, which I'm very, very excited about. And you're going to be making that big announcement, yes, isn't that right? Yes, I get to make the, exci the exciting announcement this year. Lots of fun, fun stuff coming up. Why is it important for people to come out and support this event? You mentioned it helps you guys continue your efforts with 1031 Consortium and providing a safe Halloween for everyone. Yes, you know, a lot of children are not able to trick-or-treat in their own neighborhoods, whether that's for traffic calming issues or poor lighting or crime. And so what 1031 does is we work with neighborhood associations to create safer environments for trick-or-treat. And then that serves as a blueprint for other community activities activities in the neighborhood. And if people want to come, again, it's going to be this Saturday. Where can they get ticket information to be a part of this? BlackandOrangeBash.com. Awesome. And Ziggy, what's your favorite part about being a part of a 1031 Consortium? You're going to be there this weekend, right? Oh, Halloween is my favorite Earth holiday. I don't even have to dress up. It's just the one day of the year. Nobody looks at me funny. It's the best. You get to be <laughs> yourself on Halloween. That's Halloween. right. <laughs> awesome. Well, we're going to have the details for you guys on the Black and Orange Bash on our website. That, of course, is BeOurProud.com. If you can, get out there and support this event happening this Saturday. It all helps uh, us to be able to provide a safe and fun Halloween for every child. And we're halfway there. I can't believe it. Halfway there. Halfway to Halloween. All right. Well, we're going to take a quick break.